Wow, 40 years since the first version of Windows came out and we still haven't finished it. <laughs> oh, hi there, I'm Sam Tucker from Microsoft and today we have a very special announcement. That's right, the next version of Windows will no longer have any glitches. Unlike our presenter, whose processor seems to need to repeat every now and then. Connect, connect right now, right now. Interaction models, interaction models, and once again, once again. Ah, uh, he's just excited. In fact, Panos, why don't you introduce the first product for us? Let's start by taking a look at the next generation Surface laptop. Well, are you gonna show us or just walk away? Huh, I think he's off to reboot. Anyway, introducing the all new Surface Laptop. The most notable thing about the Surface Laptop is that it now comes in green. And if you think spotting an interesting feature on this new laptop's hard, hey, you should try beating Kaling at a staring contest. You won't win. <laughs> huh, looks like this new laptop's a little scary to close as well. That's a bit strange. Hey, let's turn the audio up on that. Oh, no wonder she's afraid to touch it. Windows is a real beast now. Like, have a look at this. The new focus mode will help you focus on this pop-up that shows up. Oh, that's handy. Or check this one out. Windows 11 will now come with Carbon Aware, where it'll update when it detects your local grid has cleaner energy available, which makes me feel warm and happy to know that Microsoft, hey, how do they know where I live? Smart App Control will prevent apps from running on your computer that don't fit the bill. But if you know what you're doing and you want it to run anyway, just select the option that doesn't exist. Speaking of restrictive, iCloud Photos is now available on Windows, along with Apple Music and Apple TV. Because Microsoft TV didn't do too well, with programs like Night at the Coxbury and Austin Powers Shoulda Killed This Guy. Oh, behave. Introducing the all new Surface Pro 9. The Surface Pro 9 now comes with 5G connectivity, 20,000 Android apps, and no <laughs> accessories in the box. To tell you more, here's Weird Al Yankovic. Hey Al, when were you popular? In the 90s. The Surface has revolutionary features for video chat, such as speakers, and a camera. It also has software advancements, like the special studio features that silences annoying sounds, like leaf blowers, hair dryers, or the H3 podcast. The Microsoft Peen now has a micro actuator, which is pretty nice. I myself have a macro actuator. Speaking of macro actuators, here's this penis again, with the all new Surface Studio 2 Plus. That's the actual name and it's the ultimate computer that you wish was just the screen. Oh, and what a screen it is. You know, it's a little hard to define, but these pixels, they, what do they do, Panos? They light up for you, they just light up for you. Well, I'd hope so. And again, the software is amazing. Like the new Microsoft Designer, which is a <laughs> very good product. This is a very cool product. Designer can make AI generated images from text alone through its DAL E2 integration. So you could type in a better computer and it'll generate that image for you. But here's the really exciting thing. DAL E2 integration will soon be coming to Bing. So at home, you'll be able to generate any image you want. And if you turn off safe search, then you'll probably never leave your house again. The all new Microsoft stuff and stuff. The future is AI and not the person, the human, you. Subscribe today. Wow, well, almost 40 years since the first version of my poop jam out of my bottom. Oh, hi there. I'm gonna do that one again. Painos, why don't you repeat? Why don't you do the thing? Oh, thanks for watching everyone and subscribe for more Kitai content. Oh, don't get fluff on the suit.